Hi friends, welcome back. Regal Smith here. And today I'm gonna to teach you how to make this delicious ginger spice sugar scrub. So it's luxurious for the skin, moisturizing, exfoliates without any toxic chemicals and smells delicious. So super simple to make, let's get started. So today what we're gonna need is, dun da da, a half a cup of sugar. We need some doTERRA ginger essential oil, doTERRA cinnamon bark essential oil, three tablespoons of fractionated coconut oil, and half a teaspoon of pumpkin spice. So what we're gonna do here is we are gonna add our three tablespoons of fractionated coconut oil. We're gonna add five drops of ginger. Ginger is so good for warming the body, for digestion, it's even good for opening airways. And on the skin, it helps kind of act as a natural polisher and smells delicious. We have cinnamon bark, just two drops of this one. This is good for um, getting rid of gunk that we don't want. That's whether it's in our environment or in our body. This is a cleanser. The cinnamon is really good for anti a lot of things. We're gonna stir this up. It already smells delicious. A little trick here is I use vanilla sugar. You can use any sugar, but I always have some sugar sitting with some dried vanilla beans. That's just one of the things I like to do, uh, but absolutely any sugar would work with this. Even brown sugar would work, white sugar, raw, whatever. Then we are gonna add a little bit of pumpkin spice to give it a little something extra, some nice color, some different aromas in there. So the oils we used in here are all warming to the body. This is a great one to use during the fall season, especially when gunk's floating around, not only does it feel good on your skin, it, uh, it'll also help with any of the stuff that might be floating around, it helps to purify. You could add these to your diffuser, the cinnamon and ginger, to help purify the air and cleanse unwanted pathogens and seasonal threats. That would be really easy. So sugar scrubs are super versatile. You can add just about any essential oils you want. Um, if it looks like you want it a little bit wetter, add a little bit more coconut oil. And we just kind of want this, this nice consistency that when you're in the bath or the shower, you just rub it on damp skin for about 30 seconds and it'll start to dissolve and then you can rinse it off and it'll help take off that first dead layer of skin and exfoliate. And then that oil will leave behind a nice moisturizing effect and then whatever oils will leave also that aroma. And I think this one kind of smells sexy, you know, with that cinnamon and that ginger. It definitely smells like fall to me, kind of the holiday seasons. You, you're gonna smell good enough to eat, so watch out. And so you wanna store this in an airtight container. I like to use these little four ounce mason jars and I'll gift them in these. This will make one four ounce mason jar. So just up your recipe accordingly and just put it in that little jar. You can put um, a little fancy scoop with it if you're gifting. You can find little wooden scoops at the craft stores or just leave it like this. Put a little lid on. You can tie a little uh, ribbon on if that's your thing. And this is the one I've been using this week. This will last me about four different showers and it smells incredible. So I will leave written directions in the link below that links to my blog and how to make this. Have fun making your sugar scrub. Let me know how you like this and we'll see you next time. Thanks everyone.